Hi, this is Aaron with Zolotech, and today we have a new case for the iPad called the Omniverse. It's by Unia, and this is a padded case. It's a zip case uh, that holds your iPad securely, and there's some tags they've included. Um, designed in California, gives the dimensions, it's water resistant, uh, cushion protection, uh, it weighs 0.44 of a pound, or 0.2 kilograms, uh, has a handle that's stowable, you can hide that, which is always nice. And they've got some different sizes, so if you wanted one for a MacBook, that sort of thing, it's available. And then this is the material it's made out of. It's kind of like, it says anti-shock memory foam, and it's, it is memory foam, it returns to its uh, original, uh, original um, design. I, th I don't know if you see this wave in here. So that's what this is made of. Um, they were nice enough to send it along for review, and I appreciate that, so thank you. So here's the handle. It's got a couple snaps on it. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. And it's nylon material. So it looks like what we can do is if we don't want the handles, which I probably wouldn't use the handle, we can tuck them down in here like that. Let's see if we can do that with the other side. Now I probably should take these tags off it here. There we go. Let's do that on the other side. There we are. So, let's see if we can tuck this handle down in there. So it's got a nice Velcro piece, if you can see, right down in there. A nice Velcro piece that holds that in place. So there you have the uh, bag if you don't want the handle. So let's go ahead and unzip it. Here's the back design. Um, same square pattern, nicely stitched. Well, and it has a piece of foam in it. Oh, in a uh, moisture packet there. So here's the case. Let's go ahead and open this up. There's the case, just a little tag, and then you've got the memory foam right here. So this memory foam that was on this chain here, uh, same material inside um, everywhere. So that's nice and soft material. And the only thing that would worry me a little bit is the zipper, but it looks like it tucks up, or the uh, iPad tucks under there. So let's go ahead and see how the iPad actually fits in here. So let's tuck this under. Now it is covering up the speakers a little bit, but they are nice and loud. So there is the iPad in place. Um, I don't know if I want to shake it upside down to see if it... Yeah, it'll, it'll hold. It's, it's in there pretty good. Um, let's go ahead and turn it on and see... Uh, well, speaker-wise, I don't know if I have anything I can play uh, legally here. Uh, I don't, but I, I could hear the click uh, pretty well. It is a little bit difficult to access the buttons. So you've got the, the sleep-wake button up here. It is tough to hit that because it's under this piece here. Now, you don't have to keep it in this, this covering, and or you could just use it by flipping it over here. It is easy to pop out, uh, but it is a little bit tough to hit the sleep-wake button. Uh, the volume rocker is definitely a little difficult to get to. Um, that said, this is going to protect your iPad better than, say, the um, Apple case, which I have here, which is really flimsy and more of just a scratch protection as opposed to um, an actual shock protection. So if we go ahead and close this. now. I should know or I'll mention also there is no stand built into this so if you like the stand you're gonna have to prop it up on something um, if you want to use that use it as a stand um, but uh, other than that you can see the side there how it protrudes out a little bit but the, the rocker switch is really kind of tough to get to and the uh, rotation lock is also difficult to get to so let's go ahead and close this up And it, and it feels like it's in there quite nicely. You could use the handle or, or choose not to. Um, it, it makes for a really nice and light uh, carrying case. And I wouldn't be afraid to drop this. Obviously, I don't want to drop it from any distance, but I wouldn't be afraid to drop it, you know, just because it's nice shock protection for the uh, iPad itself. Um, but overall, if you're looking for this type of case, I think this is pretty good. I, I do like the the uh, memory foam on here. It's nice and soft. Um, it's nice and soft and, and um, looks like it's not going to scratch anything. And it's fairly thick. It is this thick. So 
uh, to give you an idea. But there are some downsides as you can't get in to here around and uh, touch the buttons, that sort of thing. But overall, I think it's a pretty decent case. Uh, the dock connector you can get to down here, um, but let me show you. You'll have to pull it down a little bit to plug it in. So, not necessarily ideal um, as far as use every day, maybe. But to, to transport, it's great. And you can easily slide it out of here. So that's not a problem. It just pops right out. And it's held in there nice and securely. And uh, this might be a good way for some people, depending on what type of case you're looking for. So that's pretty much it. That's the Unia Omniverse case right there. The Omniverse case by Unia. Check it out. Uh, they have some other great cases as well. And uh, again, thank you for sending this for me to me. And um, please comment and subscribe on the video. Uh, I appreciate that. And uh, thank you to all who have already subscribed. This is Aaron with Zolotech. We'll see you next time.